everybody, welcome back to the channel. You join us very late in the day. This is now the third, fourth time trying to record this video. <sighs> because Winston, Winston is being a nightmare. So I'll give you a quick scan of the living room. So we've got, yeah, uh huh, yeah. Hi fella. So you notice the uh, couch has been taken to pieces. Two wet patches. Oh, there's wet beds in here, and there's nothing to see in here because it's all cleaned up. So, what happened, mister? What happened? So, in today's video, what we're going to be doing is Julius K9, like that harness review videos very much, and decided to send us some other little goodies. So, what we're going to be doing today is unboxing them for you guys, showing you guys, because I didn't realise, and I'm sure a lot of you probably didn't either, that Julius K9 do a lot more than just harnesses. Now, I just thought they were a harness brand originally. Obviously now I know what to do, but originally I just thought there were harnesses like probably a lot of people do, but no, they do toys and clothes and they do a lot of other things. So, And if you do want to check Julius K9 out, if you go to the julius.store. I can never get it right. I'll put the link in the description on screen and you can use the discount code Pablo2019. That'll give you 20% off all your orders. Again, I'll put it all in the description. A lot of people have mentioned that the postage from there is quite expensive because it's from like mainland Europe. But if you're from the UK, you can also use Pablo20, which gives you 20% off harnesses. Or you can use Pablo10, which will give you 10% off your whole order. So if you're ordering leads and badges and all stuff like that, you can use that and it'll probably be cheaper than 20% off your harness. Although it doesn't work on the new long walk harness, Speaking of the long walk harness, it is now available to buy. It is very limited stock, and that's why you can't use the discount codes on them because they are very limited, so they are very exclusive. But if you're from the UK, Pablo 10 does work on the long walk harnesses, so get your order in quick because there's only like a couple of them left in stock. And if you don't know what we're talking about, it is the harness we use for Pablo. We've done a whole video on it, links will be in the description. So this is the first time we actually seen the price of it, and it is quite expensive for a harness. But obviously we're getting you guys 10% off, so you will save a bit of money there. But I would highly recommend it, and it is actually an investment because paying that much for a harness does seem like a lot, but if you think about it in the long term, joint surgery or neck surgery will be a lot more. So, and I would say it's definitely worth the money. Right, let's crack on with this video. Let's get this box unboxed, although it is already unboxed, because like I said, we have tried before. But Winston decided to wee on the couch. Right in the middle, right down the middle. So that's where he got the patch from. So I will clean all that, getting them washed and doing everything else. He was being an absolute terror and like destroyed half the living room. We just And then we took him outside, let him go for a wee or a poo or anything. Didn't do anything, that's fine. Started filming again. And then he jumped on there and weed right on there. So we'll be cleaning that. <sighs> so yes, it is already kind of already unboxed because we have tried. We have already tried. So I don't fully know what's actually in this box. I know of one item that's definitely in the box and all the other items I just got kind of like a name of, but I didn't look into them. So it's a bit of a surprise to me. We'll go through it. We'll figure them out together and we'll see what they have sent us. So, without further ado, ba, 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 ba. what have we got in here? Ba, ba, ba. Ah, ha, 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 ha. So this is the lead to match Pablo's other harness, not the long walk one, the normal IDC, the bright orange one. Now, I'm confused at what this ring is here, why there's two. Yeah, wait, so what's that? Why is there two things on the end? Can you walk two dogs with it? What's this? So it's a, hold on. What? I'm confused. So it's like split in the middle. So can you walk? Can you? Is this for like walking two dogs? Do you walk one on each side, or do you clip it to your? Is one for like the front? Ha I don't know. I thought a lead was just like a loop and one clip. I don't get what the. What's the two clips for? Winston, you tell me. You tell me. What's it for? I'm sure one of you guys will let me know what this is for and I've had the lead like this. We've just always used an extension lead, but we are going to have to train Pablo a bit better on the lead now, so we're going to have to have him beside us. So we're going to use that one instead rather than the extension because he is proving difficult with Winston. So that's going to be useful. We'll showcase that in another video because obviously now it's too late to take them out and show that. Please don't fight. Get some pajamas. <laughs> <gasps> What's this? What's this? Is that a tub toy? Get it. You get that end. 
You grind. You grind. Good boy. Pull. Go on, pull. Come on, pull you get lined. Pull you get lined. No, no, you get each end each. You get an end each. Come on, I'll pull. Uh, Winston, you are not helping. Uh, 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 Oh, we also have a second one. There's a second one. Do you have one each? If it wasn't all the camera, I could have one pull and one, and then one pull and the other. The thing about all Julius products that we found so far is they're just. Excuse me. I'm trying to do a little piece here. It's just how tough and like well made they are. I mean, Pablo and Winston are never going to destroy these kind of things. Like, they are far too strong for these. I mean for like big dogs like these are these don't feel like you know just pet shop tugs like these feel like you could put them on a car and they'd be fine just the stitching everything they're all the proper strong sturdy so for bigger dogs these would be ideal for these dogs these these two are never going to rip through anything like this what else we got we got two of these what are these what's this fella what's this oh fluorescent ball with string Okay. Who wants to press some ball with string? Ah, get! Who wants the other one? Quick, Pablo, come with me, come with me, come with me. Okay, they've probably been in the box far too long, but they are fluorescent. Need it in the sunlight a bit longer, don't we, fella? Oh, well, they seem both quite content with them, so... Sorry. So like I said, I didn't even realise like the leads came in like weird combinations. So these here, I've just been having a look at them on my phone. Can I borrow them off someone? Will someone lend me theirs? They are training chew balls, so they are made for chewing, so they are high durability. So if everybody knows what a Kong toy is, they've also got this hole in the middle here, so you can put treats inside there. Obviously, entice them with treats. Also, this handle here is adjustable. So you can have this kind of as big or as small as you want. So if you're playing tug, you can get like a really good grip on it. So it's nice and small. Or if you're playing, say, in the rain or something, and you want to just use it as like throwing a tennis ball, you know, you can just give it a whoop. So yeah, they're really cool. They'll be ideal for playing in the dark. Obviously, they'll need to be in the light a bit longer to be properly fluorescent. But they seem spot on. Now the last thing here has me really, really confused. Um, this little focus. It is a Yankee map dummy. Um, I don't know what a Yankee map is, so I don't know what a dummy is. Uh, but you open it up and there's just like Velcro and then there is with with this inside which is i don't know what this is what's this chelsea it's a buoyancy aid is this for the water then yeah oh i'm so confused at what it is i thought I it was just like so. a load of velcro yeah, no, but... tug for search so, tug for so is this the tug yeah the whole, no, thing the, tug? the whole thing's the tug because what you do is and i'm assuming it'll either make it float or it'll puff it up so then what you do is, you literally get it, and what does that say? Yeah, it's like a dummy. So what you do is, you literally get it and you chuck it. And the idea is then the dog has to go and find it. But it says tug. Tell you what we'll do. I've got it here. Thank you, up Snack training dummy. Buoyant training dummy. Ideal for retrieving and training. Can also be used as a tug toy. Durable dog toy that can float on water, making it ideal for fetch and retrieve dummy training. You want to increase your dog's confidence in water. The waterproof material protects the treats inside. And it also doubles up as a tug toy. That's Quell. 
Quail. That's quail. Quail. Because these, t well, we don't know about Winston yet in terms of water, because he's never actually been in water. He's still yet to have a bath. Wow, that went from yellow to white. Pablo can swim. He's not very fond of the water at all. But well, maybe that'll entice him if we put some treats in it. Try eating you know, all the water. Pugs are not really water animals at all. Pugs in general just don't like the water, do they? No. No, they're not. So Pablo swimming and being able to swim is quite actually a rare, I think, a rare thing. Because mm. normal pugs don't go anywhere. Well, he won't go anywhere near water, really. Yeah. That's a lead. Yeah. Why has he got like two clips on it? And why has he got like all those rings in it? What do you do? So what, the, what my expectations with that would be is that you put your arm through it and you hold it yeah and it looks like it's a training lead so what you can do is you know, the clips will be so you can ad adjust it so i'm assuming if you maybe didn't want to have both clips on it you'd just clip that on there stop it please stop it and have it just as like a handle leash yeah and clip that on but it's it'll be uh, my assumption is for people that sometimes clip the dogs at the front and the back to stop pulling so particularly uh, big dogs yeah. but then you put your whole arm through it and if you hold it like that you've got more control of the dog then okay we could absolutely be completely wrong because i, I, don't, I don't know I, i'm just guessing maybe just you can get 10 meter versions of it yeah, it's maybe one of them, like, also it'll work as, like, a retrieve lead, you know, for, like, tri tri like training a dog to be good when it's off the lead, mm. but it's technically still on the lead. Because that looks like when you pull that through, that could clip on there to make a handle. And that could clip on your dog, and that could also clip there. Julia, send us instructions next time. <laughs> yeah, we need instructions of these. Hi, we run a dog channel, but don't know how to use a lead. <laughs> The fluorescent material is only capable of illuminating after it has been exposed to natural light or official natural or official light. So that's why it's not illuminating at the moment. So obviously this is a fluorescent material. So on nighttime walks, this will be glowing up like crazy. So this will be perfect for nighttime walks. What we'll have to do is do a video actually on this. This we'll take them to the park with this and with these two late at night, and we will get them get them running up so she's doing some instagrams with the new with the new tings they are also coated in like a silicon type material so if it's wet then you get like extra grip on it because obviously it does look quite slippy but it's not they're very grippy so it's good for when you're walking them in the rain it's still very good so this is all of pablo winston's new goodies what do you think fella what do you think winston yeah winston loves it winston, winston's <laughs> loving this Everyone likes new toys, don't they? They really like they really like these chews. Really like them. I mean, they like anything they can chew, really. But yes, if we didn't have Winston causing all this, then we could have had a little bit more time to test them out properly. But what we'll do is we'll, at some point, we'll get back to you about how these have coped. Whether they've managed to chew through anything, I really highly doubt it. But sturdy. They're really well filled. Yeah, like particular. inside that, like I'm pushing that, and no way can I feel my fingers on the other side. Normally, with a dog toy, you can almost. Um... Pablo, what are you doing? What are you doing? He's the king of the castle. Yeah, normally with a dog toy, they kind of just push flat, don't they? But look at that. That's my full strength. This doesn't yeah. even go. Uh, so that's, what, that's what I said. Like a dog toy's normally feels like a dog toy whereas this feels like i don't think we'd, we're ripping through that anytime soon i mean like nah i don't think even like mini or miley could get through this sort of stuff no. this is proper proper stuff but yes to keep losing my trailer thoughts so we'll do a video of like a late night wonder with these sort of stuff and show you all the aluminum stuff we'll leave it in the um words what is it sunlight and stuff so we can get them all alumini alumini alum Aluminum. Illuminated. Aluminium. Aluminum. Aluminum. And I'm sure you'll be seeing these in a lot of videos with them playing and stuff. And we'll have to, when it gets to summer, we'll definitely give that a go because we need to take Winston and Pablo. Where are you? There you are. We need to take them to the beach again, so we'll definitely be trying that out. So yeah, that's our little like surprise delivery from Julius, and I'm sure the boys are going to thoroughly enjoy this. And we just like to thank Julius, obviously. Thank you very much for just sending us these, because I mean that's just. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's it's thank you as well for sending two of each. 
Like, like yeah, like two. Ch- even though they'll share. Well, they'll they'll, they'll they'll maybe pull on it each, or we can have one each to pull with them. So. There you go. There's just no fighting. Yeah, one each for them, and then one each for them. It's just so thoughtful, isn't it? Like. It's nice. Julie's a good people. <laughs> yeah, they're good people. They're good people. But I hope it gives you guys a little more of an insight as well to what products they sell as well. Because I didn't, like I said at the start of the video, like I didn't realise they sold anything but harnesses. But obviously they do all this stuff. And it is really good stuff. But obviously, I know for a fact in the UK, in like, well, Pet's Home is the only pet shop we have, isn't it? Yeah. There isn't another pet shop. And the only thing they sell is the original Julius Kenner harness. So like, it's just not really heard of here. So like, You're talking like people don't know. Models are going it. Yeah, like, pe- people just don't know they exist here. Oh, a lot of people have them, yeah. They're just not So it's good to see like, the other stuff good, They've got other good quality stuff. Because buying stuff like these, like I said, in pet shops and stuff, I mean, even the, like... Indestructible! Yeah, indestructible <laughs> toys. The, the, you can like you can pull them apart with your hands. Like They're, they're, just, they're just not built for quality, are they? No, not a at all. A lot of them aren't. But yeah, it's great that Julius are sending us stuff like this because... I mean, we highly rate them, and obviously, we're getting stuff sent to us now, which is just crazy. Carl, we're YouTubers. We're YouTubers, Chelsea. We're YouTubers. But hope you guys enjoyed. I will leave all the links to like Julius's website down below. The discount codes we can offer you guys. I apologise for everyone who's not in catchment area of them, but that you can only get so much. We're in the UK, so we're trying. We'll do we'll do the UK first, and then we'll we'll branch out. We'll see if we can get what we can do for the Americans and all that. So yes, drop a like comments you have down below if you've got questions about anything hit us up like i said we're not experts on it we've just learned about all these right now but we can try to help you guys out and if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button as always people peace out peace out